Hey guys, John Lux here, back with our playthrough of Final Fantasy Legend 2. Uh, yeah, there we go. All right. Last time we left off, we got to Edo, the Edo world. Uh, though they haven't given us the official name of it yet. I mean, we know. We know, it's, J it's Japan. It's Japan. We got to the Japan world, and um, apparently there's a banana issue going down and we need to equip ourselves with some new stuff all right so uh one two three four one so we have only four spaces <clears throat> um at least the gold bow and probably the giant helmet Laser Cannon, Dragon Helm. Two Dragon Helms, one Laser Cannon. A Flare Book might be super helpful actually as well. Did we look at the Dragon thing? I assume it's Strength Based. Oh, the Tank. And a Tank as well. Right, Laser Cannon, uh, bye. Dragon. And I think we don't have enough for the Tank. Well, that's what happens. You know what I mean? That's what happens. So we'll equip John. Uh, yeah, I mean, we're, we're running... Stuff is... That's the thing. It's like... Stuff is pricey, man. It's only 47, uh, you know, total, but it prevents paralysis and all status effects except for stone, which is huge. Huge! Uh, that and the dragon armor. Dragon armor protects against basically all elemental effects. Uh, the Geta sucks. We'll probably find some better boots at some other point. And then there's gold gauntlets, which we'll have to replace. We already saw that there's ninja gauntlets. I don't know what they do, but they have to be better than that. And, um, so yeah. As for the robot, we'll switch the giant armor for the dragon armor, right? 68 and 564. Yeah, way better. Way better, and... Well, I mean... <sighs> I guess it's not a huge deal. I could probably just switch this out with the girl. Um, and now we put the girl's, you know, paralysis thing. What happens if I do that, right? Let's say we'll equip the girl, because she has a defense of 21. Let's check, let's switch out the ice book for the dragon. That adds a defense of 20. Just straight up adds 20. Makes para, strong against para, redundant. Um, I'm not ready for her to, uh, you know, I, I want her to gain more defense, to be honest. So let's, let's do that for now. Oh, that's the, I, yeah, just went away. I dwell in darkness without you and it went away, right? So let's give him the dragon helm, because it's better, and then we'll switch the gold for the laser, which I believe is going to be better agility and hit points. 564 and 43. Wow. An extra 60 hit points and an extra, like, 13 agility. That is out freaking standing. We need to switch Bazooka for tank at some point and then maybe switch the flame shield out for... Well, we'll probably get a dragon shield at some point. Um, does laser cannon affect groups? I don't know. I feel like maybe not. And if that's the case, then whatever. It's the same as the laser sword. And honestly, just remember, even if this is fixed damage, which it probably is because it's a gun, the extra agility will make the laser swords more powerful because they are agility-based. 
Let's sell... Should I sell the kick? We'll sell the gold bow, because we're not re-equipping that. Uh, giant... Eh. Army... <laughs> 700. Alright. I haven't used it the whole game. We're up to 40,000 now. Can I buy a tank? Down to 5,000. Alright. Adds extra hit points. Not much else. But still... It does way more damage. Wait. It's group, right? Pretty sure tank is group. Let's go outside. We'll find out. We will find out. Alright. Ichigoya. Wait, where's the mushroom? I wonder where it should go. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. We, we saw that already. What's going on, Jack? What are you smelling right there? Alright. Um... Did we do the inn? Yes. We didn't cross the bridge. Did we talk to the robot? No. Hear that our Shogun is a bit soft in the head. I don't know what that means. Um... We'll talk to them in a minute. Let's wander around just for a bit. Oh, there you go. You didn't have to worry about it. Tarantula 4, let's say tank, because I want to know if it affects everyone. Sleep, we'll say defense. Group. Yep, there you go. Now you know. It's group. Sell the bazooka. Or... Let's check the laser out. I don't know if that's group as well. Um... Punch, sleep, gold. Just to one. Good to know. So it's basically a, like the laser sword. We'll just... Eh. Alright. Agility up, defense up. Aw, oh, yeah. Whoa. <laughs> Hermit Crab, all right. Talk to me, dude. What about the laser sword now? What does that do? Laser! Or... Okay. Lost Ice Acquired Hypnos. I think that's the same thing as Charm. Basically, I'm not gonna worry about it. What about over here? We got bridges and stuff. Oh, what is this? Little town. Uh, is this the harbor? I know there's a harbor. I'm... I didn't expect there to be fights, though, to be honest. I figured it'd be like, you know, like a town. Tank. Oh, ferry! Okay, well... Punch him, I guess. We'll just keep using it. 140-something, though. That's pretty decent. Although for, you know... Whoa! Um... Punch. Thunder. Gold. Yeah, there you go. Yeah, whatever. Shoot those fairies. Girls' defense up. That's what I'm talking about. Let's explore. Let's explore. Girls' defense. Oh, defense 23. I was like, hang on, 37? That's not right. Alright. I know at some point there's gonna be a boat. That's really all I... We gotta go on the boat. Is this it? No. Like I said, I know there's a boat. I don't really know much else. Anaconda Ferry. Um... <laughs> F 
400. That extra... Yeah. That extra defense helps a lot. Tank, punch, thunder, gold. Oh, just one? All right. Okay, so the harbor, we've checked out the harbor. Oh, wow, yeah, Phantom, Wyvern, Gabolg, Jibolg, whatever. We'll say Thunder, or Ice. Say Ice for you, Sleep. Five hundred damage. Right on. Ouch! Girl got stabbed. Girl got hit, dude! Strong against thunder. I did not know this. Um... Let's try ice. I'm gonna cure myself, maybe? Uh, that's the wrong button, son of a bitch! Strong against ice, also. Okay. Oh, John has good defense, though, so that's interesting. Gurley's cure for Go Ghost doesn't help. Um. Cure her. Sleep. Hypnos, I guess. I don't know. There you go. A bulge meat. Yeah, I'm just gonna pass. I'm gonna, we're gonna. We're gonna pass for now. Boom. She's not full, but close. 408. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. Pretty good. Alright. So, little harbor place. Um, I don't mind getting extra monies running around here, you know? Laser sword. Um, we'll punch. Let's try Hypnos, actually. That's confused, right? Strong against poison. There you go. Because of the dragon armor. Nothing happened. Hmm. Well. All right. Okay. That's the court. High encounter rate. Uh, you know, it's understandable. Punch. Sleep. Uh, thunder. mana. Very nice. Alright. Let's hit up the inn. We'll see what those people on the bridge want. I'm sure they're friendly. Sure, they're completely friendly and bear no ill will for anyone. We have, you know, we have some money now. So 11,000, 12,000, whatever. That's good. That's a good start. Considering we're spending, what, 36 grand on a single item? So, yeah. But, uh, yeah, ability-wise, we're doing okay. 36 agility, 36 mana. Uh, 23 defense without armor. Without armor, mind you. 41 mana. She needs to defend more, but we, I think, overall need to get stronger. <clears throat> Robo. We got some laser swords. Um, and a laser cannon and a tank. Those are all good. Those are all good things. Hey you, where do you think you're walking? This road belongs to us Hatamotos. Well, it's not a road, it's a bridge. 
Hey, move. Beat him, guys. Alright, well, you're, uh... Let's use... I just... I guess... Oh, hey, uh... Hmm, do we want to punch? No, I think not. Let's thunder him. Or ice him. Sleep. Thunder. Ooh, excuse me. Hatamoto group. The Hatamotos were the issue, I believe, in this town. Ice. And... Right on. Magnum, John's Monarch. Hatamoto. No more playing, man. Get him! Wait a minute. I am Hana. I am the town's detective of this Edo. You Hatamotos! That wasn't the best way to greet strangers. It was impolite. Tut. We'll let you go this time. Huh. Now, all settled. Are you okay? I mean, they're still there. Girl, yeah. And, uh, I don't know what happened there. I don't remember. Go, go. Wow, she's cool. So we can get across the bridge now. Did we take any damage? Yet. So... Another weapon shop. All right. I don't mind. I mean, I'm hoping there's cooler weapons. Ice sword. Right. We got attacked with one of those once. Mage Vulcan. Uh, I mean, seems like the tank is better. Oh, baby. Cat claw. Best, um... Coral, ogre, laser, judo. Catclaw, from what I understand, best uh, agility weapon in the game. I have no problem equipping, you know, changing our laser swords out for cat claws. I have no issue with that. Man, my neck is all tight. Ugh, okay. Um. Oh yeah, let's well let's sell right. We got um. The bazooka, let's sell that. Magnum. Ah. Uh, yeah. Sell. We got 25,000. Alright. So let's pause here. Pause here. We'll take a look. We'll take a look at what, uh... Alright, talk to me. And, right, I mean, you know, we had a flame, so it makes sense that there would be an ice. Um, so mage, I believe that's what they were selling. I mean, we'd got that before. Mana times eight, all enemies fire. Meh. <clears throat> Cat claw. 99 hit points to the robot, agility plus 22. Damage, agility times 13. Worth it. Worth it, I say. <clears throat> Excuse me. Now, where was the laser again? Um, hmm. uh, Vulcan has more uses than the tank. Not as good hit points. And uh, less damage does not block melee attacks. So, I mean, we'll stick with the tank. Vulcan is cheaper. More uses, I mean, you know, it's it's hard to choose. Kimono, that's an armor? Where do you get this from? I don't know. Uh, laser, 11, or 117, agility plus 26, 350, range attack, no defense. No defense, I assume it means it bypasses defense. We'll stick with that. Um, maybe switch one of our laser swords out for <clears throat> the cat claw. Because laser. Oh, coral. What's coral? Strength weapon. Effective against group, insect, spider, beetle, and moth. No. Um, ice. 81. It's a strength weapon also. Ice attack. Eh. 
Damn, dude. Excuse me. There's so many things, right? So many things. You know, there's not many boots. Hermes Hecate, Hecate, whatever. There was um, the Geta. Boots are kind of, you know, whatever, I guess. They're just not uh, really considered. <clears throat> All right, what else? What else was there? Battle suit or battle armor? Yeah. Door teleport to visit town. Where um hmm. I don't know. Anyway, uh so right. Let's go with uh Oh, was there a dragon sword? Was that one of the things? That's the case, that's a strength weapon as well. All right, so dragon and coral are both physical strength-based swords. Yeesh. All right, ice, which is physical, mage. Uh, you know, it's okay. <clears throat> it's like a better, better flame spell. Vulcan, not as good as the tank. Catclaw, best. We need one of these. Coral. Oh, I didn't look at the ogre. Was there a dragon sword? I didn't see one, no. Ogre, what is ogre? I assume, I assume strength weapon, probably. Axes. I don't think I've come across an axe that's a strength, that's not a strength weapon. We already have a laser. Lasers are good. We need a catclaw. We need one. Let's just double check what the ogre weapon is, though, the ogre axe. I just want to know. I just want to be sure. Uh, the rune axe, thunder axe, ogre axe, strength. Effective against spirit, goblin, fiend, and sprite. Okay. Okay. Hopefully you can't hear my lip smacking and stuff. That would be a little bit awkward, I think. Which means you probably can hear it, and if you cannot, well, I apologize, unless you're into that sort of thing. Alright, we need a cat claw. At least one. Everything else, I mean, we've already got a laser. Judo would be good for later, um, but, you know. Alright. What else is past here? Hey, flower person. A girl named Hana, Hana means flower, we're talking to flower, took the place of her lost father as a detective. That's cool. Uh, kimono, which sucks. Samurai shield, dragon shield, battle armor, curse excure. All right, so we looked at the battle armor had strength, which is, I mean, not as good as the dragon armor, because dragon armor blocks against, like, elements. Right? Kimono, pretty awful. Uh, I think maybe they're just selling it because Japan. Samurai and dragon shield. I don't know much about these. I know dragon shield is probably awesome. Samurai shield also probably awesome, just because of the price. So let's look up, um... Let's look more closely at Kimono, Battle, Samurai, and Dragon. I pushed the wrong button there. Son of a bitch. Well, damn it. <laughs> That's fine. We'll go make that money up. <laughs> oh, Jesus. All right, anyway. All right. So Dragon Shield, 
Block melee and petrify, 90% success. Strong against fire, ice, thunder, and poison, and barrier covers the party. So it's similar to the actual dragon armor, the chest armor. Um, and that's actually pretty decent. We're using the gold shield now, I think, or flame. Defense 18, so we'd get a defense bump as well as a hit point bump by about 30 and another 8 defense. Good. Plus an extra 10% chance of success. Like, we're talking 90 90% chance to block and um, blocks essentially all elements for the party. Now, Samurai Shield, I don't know anything about. I assume because it's cheaper, it's probably not as good. Since it's not a dragon, probably also does not block all of that stuff. Samurai Shield, block melee, 90% success. Oh, change. Oh, change is what exactly? Um, is it in this one? Where uh, general guides or let's say mutant skills guide? We want oh, change. We want to know about oh, change. I assume oh, change is some status effects, but not all. Oh, change right here. Uh, oh, weapon. Whoa. But I assume that's only for the person, though, that uses it. Strong against weapon, strong against paralysis and poison and stone. So if you use it, presumably it, like, it doesn't create a barrier. Okay. No barrier. For that turn, presumably if you use it before you get attacked... I assume a weapon. I think it halves weapon damage. And prevents all status ailments. Which is good, but you have to use it. It doesn't create a barrier. So it's... Eh. I mean, as far as a skill for your mutant, oh, change is freaking amazing. But... Yeah. On the shield... Not, not great. Kimono is defense plus 10 and agility plus 5, which is good. Which is good. Defense plus 10, how does that compare? Well, giant armor, which is not as good as we're using, is defense plus 20, so it's weak. What about battle armor? Defense plus 26, strength plus 5, so it's strong. Uh, right, battle armor is defense 26. What about the dragon armor? Where does that compare? That's the question. Uh, dragon armor is defense plus 21. So you lose five defense. The dragon armor is not as good from a defense perspective. Uh, but you don't get strong. You don't get protection from elements. And it just boosts your strength by, was it five? Where was, yeah, five. Okay, so dragon shield is the way to go, unfortunately. And that's why I feel like you should need, you know, you need to look this stuff up. In game, it would be nice if it told you. But it doesn't. So, you know, you kind of need to know the rules of the game. You need to know the pros and the cons. One of these lasers we're going to switch out for the cat claw. Maybe both. And uh, this we're probably going to switch out for the dragon shield. Let's check and see what this dude has again, but we'll do it from the normal perspective right here. Kimono, no. Samurai. If you use it, it's amazing. If not, no. Dragon, yes. I'm reasonably certain we're going to find all this stuff at some point. However, I would not sniff at purchasing it now. Uh, and it would be nice to have it for my robot now, along with a cat claw. If I could get one cat claw and a dragon, I feel like we'd be potentially set for the rest of the game. You know, I know the cat claw is the. I mean, there's a samurai bow. I don't know if that's better or not. Um. 
Where was Hana? So we saw Hana. Okay. That's a mushroom. That's not Hana. Does she have her own house? That's the question. That's also a robot. That's Ichigoya. You know, I mean, he's gonna be a villain. We know this. You can tell just by looking at his face. So, the fact that maybe we should buy some flare books now before he ceases being a shopkeeper? Uh, Aegis, Punch, Sleep, Gold. Because I really like... Whoa. I really like Girl... Uh, to get more... Um... Defense. Strong against thunder, well... Shoot with a laser. Ask and you shall receive, perhaps. Um... Eh, we'll shoot it with lasers. Punch. Sleep. I know it's strong against sleep and thunder, but... We'll shoot with another laser next time. Right on. Not terrible. Is it weak to ice? Or does ice hurt it at all? We might not get a chance to find out. Oh, it's defending. Strong against ice as well. Oh, blocked punch. Well. And laser bypasses defense, so... Probably huge. Huge! Are we at 30 minutes already? What the F? This is the court. This is the court. Yep, nobody here. Um... Well, let's wander around. I mean, the... You know, there's some trees. They're not banana trees. I really wonder if the bananas come from Venus's world. So this is shooting for about 400, and the laser sword actually does about 500 at this point. So... Tank. Oh, defeated one. Well, okay. 700. Yeah. John's agility up. You know, I'll take it. Oh. That's nice that the forest matches the, uh... Meets up with, the The mountains, I guess. Right? Uh... Laser... Gun... That seems really cool, I don't know why. The, uh... Man, we're down to five. It's probably gonna be shit damage still. I mean, you know... Relatively speaking, it'll... be good, but... Um... Let's use I just punch sleep. I, I remember, uh, like, I never played all the way through the Seventh Saga, but one of the characters in the Seventh Saga was a robot that you could choose from. You would like, seven different characters to choose from for your party. And, um, one of them was a robot, and he's like, my body will transform when it needs a weapon. And it kind of makes sense, like, the magic that you got was, like, lasers and stuff, so... It didn't specifically tell you that he was transforming, but it's like, you level up and you get laser two or whatever, you know? So... Um... And I kind of... I kind of... 
feel like that's how it is here. Like, the robots, you know, transforming to get a laser cannon or whatever. Alright, defense is 25. Not bad, I mean, you know, it could definitely be worse. Uh, uh, these headphones actually are kind of hurting me a little bit, honestly. Mm. Uh, yeah, we'll use I just punch sleep gold. He's asleep. Right on. 200 damage. Pretty dang good. Pretty gosh darn good. Well. Agility's up. What are we at for? Not yet. That was the harbor. Okay. What else is around here? Are there dungeons or something? Another town? Hana's father was investigating Echigoya, the, the shopkeeper. I mean, of course he's a villain. Did you see that face? Did you see that smile? Hana's father was murdered by Echigoya's men, I bet you. This is Hana. Before we talk to her, let's meander around. Because there's more shops. I mean, look at this. Uh, let's see. Okay. Curse X Cure, I drop Soft Cure. Heal, Heal Staff, we're gonna need those in the future, but hopefully not now. Cure and Elixir. Random house, uh, a turtle in it. Kame, Hana's father was my boss. He told me to watch after her, but she is such a tomboy. Yeah, tomboys are good. <laughs> Is it true that a guardian came to the Edo? I don't know. Dad's dead. Oto-san. Bananas are going around secretly. Or opium. Weapon shop? What do we have here? That is the question. Flame Sword, X Kick, this is like old weapons. Psy, Fire, Death, Magnum, Bazooka, Thunder. None of this stuff. None of this stuff. Still, I mean, I'm glad it's here. Did we talk to Bananas? You're talking about Bananas? Bananas, B A N A N A S. Guardian came to Edo? I don't know, maybe. Look at all these people. Monsters. Is that a Chocobo? A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N. Ouch! I bit my tongue. I hate doing that. Hi, do you like it here in Edo? The mushroom's not moving. Is he dead? He's asleep. Ancient gods made this world, right? Then, who made the ancient gods? I don't get it. Hello, how are you? I'm learning how to speak English. How am I talking with you? That is a great question, actually. An octopus and a squid. How many legs altogether? Mmm, 16? So they each have an 8. Yeah, the answer is 18. You're smart. Oh, well, thank you. Did that do anything? No. It used the healing sound, so I wondered. Taro, I'm teaching these children here right now. All right. Good to know. Uh, let's heal. That's sleep. That's not heal. Uh, that was full health. Uh, okay, we're good. We're good. We just need to rest at the end to get our charges back. Oh, that's not actual... It just looks like trees. Because it's a picture of trees. It still blocks you like trees, though. Good to know. Let's talk to Hana. Alright, we almost have enough. 
Oh, <laughs> almost have enough. 63 mana. <sighs> Alright, talk to me, girl. Ooh. Bed's right there. <laughs> Hold on, let me grab you by the obi and I'll spin you around. Oh, hi. I'm sorry about the Hatamotos. They are really troubling us all, but we can't do anything about the big guys. Girl. Detective, looks like a hard job. Hana. Yeah, but I'll do it till I avenge my father. Girl. Avenge? Hana. Yeah, my father was investigating on Ichigoya's smuggling, but he was... I've got to get Ichigoya arrested. Robo. Ichigoya. We should see what's going on. Only if I can get their ship. We did mention the harbor, but we didn't fully explore the world yet. Even though the world is big, it feels small. Because we can't go anywhere else. Let's go up. Up here. We'll go around. Tarantla 3. Laser. We'll punch one. Sleep. Gold. Um, yeah, ouch. Cobweb. <sighs> Do we want a tank? Let's use a tank. I like the tank. John's agility up. That makes me feel good. It's probably not going to help us too much. Agility's 40. That's awesome. That is awesome. He's probably behind on his mana, though. That's a problem. She's good. She needs more defense, dude. You know? All right, we got mountains. We got rocks. And, uh, yeah. Okay. The town is surrounded by poorly spaced trees, so I can't get through them. But the rocks, well... Oh, I see the walls are keeping the trees out. Now I understand. Hermit crab? Ah, uh, flame, whatever. Punch it. Man, we're down to two. If this wasn't like a first world weapon, like the beginner martial art, we'd probably like kill gods. You know what I mean? Like, watch. 130, okay, so 138's not great. It'll probably do 500 the next time around. Um, wait, 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 wait. No, you are not to flame the thing. You are to laser it. Thunder gold. All right. Excellent. Girl needs more defense. Yo, girl, you thicker than a bowl of oatmeal. <laughs> Let's punch it. We'll see what happens. See? That's what I mean. The last punch. Bam. Max HP up. All right. That's how you do it. Still. Okay. Thunder Ice. Do we have a fire book? All right, let's equip a fire book. That way, at least, we have, you know, all the different things. And then we'll want maybe, what, an X, X kick or something. This is a bit more of a grindy style episode, I guess. I'm all right with that, though. I mean, you know, it's... This game can be grind... Oh, oh okay. So it's, the world is not actually very big. We have 26,000. Let's go buy us a... Do we... Mm, or would we like a dragon shield? I have a feeling like we're going to find a cat claw. I know it. I know we're going to find a dragon shield at some point. We're probably just going to find one cat claw, though. So if I buy one, increase our agility, and then we find another one, then my robot will be... Like a metal god. Right? Okay, let's laser. Let's laser this one. 
And I don't know. I mean, you know, I'm curious about the... Uh... Um... Oh, well, this thing's... Yeah, all I have are books. That's potentially a problem. Is it strong as fire as well? Yes. So we need, like, an agility thing. That's fine. Girls defense up. Aw, yeah. Let's do Cat Claw. I need... Or... Maybe like an X Kick or something, because... I, I don't know. Let's... Are we gonna stop here? Maybe we should stop here. Let's, let's heal up first. We'll hit up the inn. We have two leads. We have Ichigoya or the Harbor. Probably the Harbor. Because they talked about the ship. And... I'm going to be annoyed if Echigoya is, is gone. He he won't be. He won't be, right? Because he doesn't want me going past his little counter. Is this Ichigoya's shop? Yes. There he is. See, look at that face. Look at that innocent little face. That's, you know, that's not innocent. It's not... <laughs> Uh, uh, let's check, let's check it out. Oh, Judo. Judo's the one. 36,000. Well, you know. Let's save. We'll stop. I have to stop for today. I want to keep going really badly, but we'll stop. Man, John's at 778. That's impressive. That's really impressive. I wouldn't mind getting to 999. That would be awesome. Uh, but anyway, guys, that's it for today. Thank you guys so much for your time and attention. I really do appreciate it. I really hope you guys are enjoying these episodes. I'm having a great time. I feel like I'm... I really feel like I'm doing well. It really makes a difference having... Like, knowing what each of the items do and knowing how the mechanics work in the game. It's almost like knowing the rules of the game helps you play better. I know, it's weird, right? Um, that said... Any questions, comments, concerns, good, bad, or indifferent, let me know. I do read all of them. I try to respond to everybody. Um, you know, if you like the video, like and subscribe and share and, and do all that all stuff. Watch all my videos if you... <laughs> if you want, if you want, watch all my videos. I do a lot of variety stuff, so... Um, there aren't many other RPGs at the moment, but RPGs are something that I plan to do more of in the future. So we'll see. We'll see. Uh, what is your guys' unique positive moment for today? For me, it's... Uh, I mentioned that roast a few episodes back. Um, it turned out really good, actually. It was um, just like a beef beef roast. And uh, I don't know if you could maybe take out some of the ingredients. I did, I did the pressure cooker for about four hours, and it just falls apart. It is, like, seriously amazing. Um... It didn't really soak into the meat like I was hoping it did. Maybe you just need to baste the juice on top of it like a, like a turkey. But the fact, it's basically in French onion soup. And that's what it was. It's, you know, you put the beef in, you put in French onion soup. Um, like the mix, specifically. Although I got like a condensed... A can of condensed French onion soup, you just add water to it, and then it's the soup itself. Uh, that heavy whipping cream and some red wine. You could probably just do the French onion soup and be good. It's like a roast... If you've ever gotten, like, a, you know, roast beef sandwich, like, French onion sandwich or whatever, you have the little bit of soup, and you take the, the beef sandwich, you dip it in the, in the French onion soup. It's basically the same thing. I don't think you near I don't I really don't think you need to add the the heavy whipping cream. The red wine you might actually have to add to it, at least a little bit of it, because it helps tenderize the meat. 
Uh, that said, it turned out really well, and my unique positive moment is the cats actually liked it. So, like, the, the, the juice itself, the soup, the soup plus all the, the heavy cream and the wine and the some of the grease that came out of the, the beef. You know, I, I ate some of that. And then, uh, you know, you have the plates left over, and I like to have the cats. I like to put the plate down, and the cats can clean it off, and they loved it. Or at least Jack did. Manny was, eh. But Jack was like, I'm gonna finish this whole freaking plate. He licked it clean. I'll probably give him a little bit more of that. Um, but that's my unique positive moment. My unique positive moment. That the kitties liked it. Uh... But that's mine. Hopefully your guys is just as good, if not better. Hopefully better, of course. And I hope to see you guys next time. Till then, guys, take care.